My name's Rich Whitworth, I'm the editor of the Analyst Scientist. I'm here at ASMS 2015 and well the GC Orbitrap is right beside me, now called the QExactive GC. I'm here to speak to some experts who've already been using the GC Orbitrap technology and will share their stories. My research group is focused on the use of technology and analytical chemistry methods to make measurements of biological molecules in cell, cellular systems for the purpose of understanding basic biology all the way up to um, understanding human disease. The main challenge is, is that um, in biological systems, for example, um, any type of human tissue or fluid, there's a tremendous complexity of molecules that you really need to be able to monitor, understand which molecules are there, how much of them are there, and, and that changes with time. And this complexity is a real analytical challenge. How can we monitor all these molecules in a fast way and you need to be able to do it fast because you want to be able to look at hundreds or thousands of people if you want to really understand humans and human disease. Well the primary technology that my group is focused on using is mass spectrometry and in mass spectrometry we have um, for the last 10 years relied heavily on ion trap and orbit trap mass analyzer technology to study proteins and small molecules uh, primarily metabolites. Having just introduced the system uh, here at ASMS yesterday, uh, we've noticed already a lot of folks very excited about the data we've shown and how they might be able to integrate the system into their own workflow. The GC Orbitrap is a major contribution to the field because while the, the technology of GCMS has been around and very mature for 50 years and is applied in many fields, one area of weakness has always been that when we apply these technologies in, in my field, which is biomolecule and metabolites, a lot of these molecules we can't identify with the older technology, that we don't have the ability to get enough information from the mass spectrum to confidently identify the, at least half of the things we can detect. And we know these things are important biologically. So what the GC Orbitrap does is it brings that accurate mass and high resolution that, it, that has transformed the LC field and protein analysis and it brings it to small molecule field and we can use that ac accurate mass and leverage it to get to chemical composition and from chemical composition we can get to structure and this this is really going to change the depth at which we can characterize the small molecules in our samples and um, how, how well we can track them. Okay. Having had a QExactive GC in the lab for about three months now. We're really excited about how easy to use it is and how much we've been able to do with it. For example, we've already profiled 1,200 metabolomes from yeast. And that's been nonstop uh, usage of the system. It's produced outstanding data and it's already allowed us to make biological insight coupled to proteomic data that we have uh, that we wouldn't have otherwise gotten and it, it dovetails beautifully with the existing proteomic technology. I really think this instrument is going to have a, a tremendous impact in the field of metabolomics because it's going to offer the ability to bridge this gap of uh, not knowing what we've identified but trying to figure out what it is and connect that to the biology. But I also think anybody who's interested in a quality quantitative instrument but also identification, both of those things in a full scan uh, GC platform is really going to benefit from this instrument. So I anticipate it's going to be quickly adopted from metabolomics to environmental to toxicology, all these areas and, and uh, others in between. The Orbitrap Mass Analyzer has really transformed our field in, in that it offers a broad dynamic range, it offers uh, a high resolution, and it offers accurate mass. And those three things combined allow you to identify more compounds, whether they be proteins or small molecules, in a shorter period of time than any other uh, uh, mass spectrometer on the market today.